Hey everybody, we're down here in Houston, Texas at the Hartwig Akuma Tech Center. We're having our open house today, and in case you missed it, I want to take you inside, see some of the technology that we have here. Let's see what we have in the shop today. Here we have the Big Beast LU7000EX, our leading oil and gas production lathe. V12 multifunction upper turret with a maximum turn diameter of 35.43 with a V10 lower turret, maximum turn diameter of 26.37. We have a milling split of 3500 RPMs with 20 horsepower ready to haul some material. Hi, I'm Jake Beans from Akuma America. I'm an applications engineer. I have the M460 5AX next to me. Uh, it's a five axis machine with true simultaneous five axis, 400 millimeter table, it can hold 48 tools, and it's pretty much a universal machine for anything you might possibly want to do. This is Okuma's best kept secret, in my thought. It's a Moltis P250. It's a very compact V-axis multitasking blade. It comes with a 40 tool ATC standard. Uh, this particular model has a 60 tool ATC. It's a captive C6 spindle with 12,000 RPMs on the V-axis head. And this machine comes standard with the collision avoidance system, keeping crashing. And it also comes standard with advanced one-touch conversation programming system. This is a Sagami MOA SY um, repped by REM, 12 position live tool turret, Y axis stroke of 1.96 inches, max machining diameter of 11 inches, comes standard with an 8 inch 3 jaw chuck. Machine is roughly 12,000 pounds coming in at, um, very economical and with the new Fanic OITF plus control on it. So, shops that are really familiar with Fanic, they're going to lean more towards this. Um, operators ready to go from other brands to get back onto this Sagami here. This is the Gemini's GT5i. This is a large capacity CNC lathe with 55 inch swing and 160 inch between centers. This particular machine is a four bed guideway design which allows you to have multiple accessories on the back side while the carriage rides on the front side. Fully programmable tailstock with an NC quill. This machine also is equipped with the quick change carriage, so you can change over from the 12 station live tool turret with Y axis that's currently on the machine to the heavy duty four position turret or to a large capacity boring bar device capable of carrying a boring bar up to 200 millimeters in diameter and three meters long. This is Okuma's newest uh, vertical machining center in the Genos line. This is the Genos M660. It has a 60 inch by 26 inch table size, so a lot more travel than what you're used to seeing. It's a 3,300 pound table limit on this machine, and it's still a double column style construction with a 32 tool ATC standard on this machine. This is Okuma's uh, 1200 BTM YB, so it has Y axis and a full contouring V axis head. It can handle up to 60 inch diameter parts, so very large part machining capabilities. Thanks everybody, hope you enjoyed what you see today. And hey, we would love to have you down here, not just for an open house, but anytime you want to visit, you can use that link below, schedule a private tour. Again, we have these machines under power. You can get a test cut. Thank you guys very much, and we'll see you soon.